DIY guy here. This is Gigi. Gigi's very sad. Gigi needs to have the alternator replaced, the super time belt replaced, and the tensioner pulley replaced in one job. Because Gigi's not running right now. So let's get on with the Italian job. Smash that like button, subscribe to the channel, and be in the know for the next video in the series uh, in the Penny DIY Guy channel. And we're gonna get at this. It's a bit of work. It's a small car, but it's a bit of work. So get your Campari, your Grappa, whatever else you want, big bowl of pasta, and a lot of patience. And you're gonna shrink your hands at least by half this size, because there's not a lot of space under the hood, which you'll see in the video coming right up. So let's go. Hammer that thumbs up button, hit the subscribe button, give that bell icon a slap to turn on channel notifications. Morning everyone, it's a DIY Canadian guy. We are going to tackle the Italian job. Uh, and this little 2013 Fiat 500 um, basically needs serpentine belt replaced, the tensioner pulley replaced, and, well, the alternator is seized, housing is cracked. It's a big job. So, I've gone ahead and done a few things already under the vehicle. I raised it up and we put uh, jack stands under it under the frame. Make sure you do that on both sides. E-brake is on so the vehicle is secure and solid. You need to be crawling under there unless you have the uh, luxury of a hoist in your garage. I do not. So you'll have to get under it uh, and do the work that way. Um, so once you have that done, the uh, passenger front wheel is off. We'll get to that later. We'll get into the hood, under the hood. First thing you do before you do anything else after the vehicle is raised, disconnect the battery. Negative first, positive terminal next, so you don't cause any sparks or shorts. Uh, if you leave this uh, connected, you don't want to, because if you do, you'll wind up shorting something, burning the ECM out, or doing some other electrical damage to the vehicle that uh, will cost you a lot more time and money. You also want to remove the engine cover, which is really easy. There's a tab here, and a tab there, this one here, and there's one there. Just pop it off and put it to the side. And the hood just basically uh, will be uh, secured with the standard, um, no, the standard bar thing about what's it. Basically, it will go here and hold the hood up so you can see what you're doing. So the serpentine belt actually was burned and you can see, that's uh, the air conditioner, you can see the remnants of the, uh, the burnt uh, serpentine belt because the alternator seized and everything sort of went to hell. So the trick with um, these lovely little Fiat's is space. So if you're like me, I have big digits. Big digits, little space, and a few words come to mind like uh, stronzo or cafone or man tutto faccio di mia. Anyway, that's for another video. All right, so I've done a little bit more work already. The passenger front wheel has been removed. And we'll get under the vehicle in a few minutes and I'll show you what you need to do to prepare for this uh, operation, which is a fairly major piece of work. Hammer that thumbs up button, hit the subscribe button, and give that bell icon a slap to turn on channel notifications.